that's how my hunt starts out. Hopefully I can get a ride. I've got cash and pizza. That definitely doesn't sound scary. I'm Austin Manoa, Commissioner Alaska. You're watching a DIY sheep hunt here in South Central Alaska. There you go, pick dog. Here we go. Good boy. Go. So I hiked all night to get down to this creek and I'm gonna go do a big float to the base of a mountain, hike up and over and hit another creek and uh, hopefully score a sheep along the way. Uh, use this pack raft to my advantage on these little creeks. Just kinda gotta watch out for all these sweepers and debris in the river. Should be a pretty good float. Perfect little pack rafting stream. coming down a pretty mellow section here but this has been really intense and highly technical in these small creeks we're really glad i have a life jacket and i'm bummed that uh i didn't grab princesses hey buddy good boy i'm doing so good Steady. I needed a clear shot. Kind of got to watch out for all these sweepers. This is just incredible here. The movement's been very minimal. So hot. Right down there. Down on the saddle. I'm beginning to think that I wasn't going to find one up here today. Oh man, right here's good blood. This is going to be the meat that I eat for the rest of the year. Maximum effort. I'm talking. This is this is max as daddy gets. I'm going to show you an awesome side. We just get to walk up on this big Kentucky flat tail. So I made it down the little stream that I was on and I looked up just on this hillside right here and I see some rams real low. So I'm going to ditch the raft, pull out all my gear and just go up for one night and head in that direction see if I can't get on them. Looks like there's a legal ram in with the bunch so basically I'm going to get out of the chest waders, get into my boots and go up. Through the forest for our last couple of 
couple hours. Next stop, I'll be able to tell these rams are legal or not. Rams, right in there. My game plan is to go up, get to this bench, shoot across. Hiking up this ridge. I just dropped my pack. I know. I know that there's a sheep over here. A legal one. I'm 300 yards away from these sheep. One of them, at least, is legal. I'm gonna shoot that ram. Yes. I've got a ram down. Crix's dog and I have a ram down. Now we gotta hike down in this canyon and go get him. No, he's down here somewhere. I just gotta go get him safely as possible. Come on, buddy. Look what we got. Wow, there he is. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Oh my gosh. Thank you, Lord. Good boy. You did so good. You did so good.
is the reason why I live in Alaska 365 days a year. Um, my wife knows me well enough that uh, she knows that I need to get out and come and beat the wild man out of me and um, be much more pleasurable to be around during the winter even if I just get to come out and hang out in the mountains with these uh, beautiful animals. That's a big deal having a strong marriage and your wife knowing who you are and uh, telling you to go out and go be who you are and it's really a blessing. I love you Jordan, thank you very much for letting me come out here babe and be me. I promise I'll be good all winter long. I'm almost back down the tree line. And me, Crixus, Mr. Ram, we're all headed down from up there. Higher than those trees. Oh man. I'm putting in maximum effort. I'm talking, this is as max as daddy gets, for sure. All right, well, I made it back to the trees and uh, I'm gonna call it night. Mm, that was tough. I'm uh, pretty dehydrated um, from that excursion. So I'm gonna call it night. I'm gonna lay down right here. I got my bivy sack and my camp right here. I'm gonna shut her down. Time for night night. Well, it's not a dream. I made it down here. This is where I'm gonna camp right here. He's gonna kick out a little spot. Crick's is gonna snuggle with me. He's over here doing his he thing. I got to meet up in a tree. And uh, it is time for night night for sure. For sure. I'm, I'm exhausted. I'm drained. That was tough. I've got another big day tomorrow to get back down to the raft and hopefully link up with another little creek and then uh, get out of here. <sighs> night night. Oh, man. Uh, yesterday and the day before were really big day. I'm moaning and groaning like an old man because quite honestly, I'm getting up there in age. And this slow back is, is put up with a lot. So, I gotta get back down to the raft and my little stash, get back over to another creek and um, float. So, and I gotta get it all together and then hike. And when I get the raft, that's gonna be a really heavy situation. But, that's all right, my, you know, might as well do this in your 30s. Oh, yeah, yesterday was a huge day. Woke up after hiking all night and um, rafted down a small stream and then uh, came right up on a, a group of sheep down low in the canyon. And I could see that there was a, a few rams in there that I needed to get a closer look on. And uh, when I got up, I was looking at the sheep for quite a while. I just didn't know if any of them were legal. One was broomed really heavy and he was real close to being there, and then there was another one that was uh, really close to being there again, but um, I wasn't messing around and trying to film a whole bunch. I was trying to uh, put the hammer down and judge these rams, so. <coughs> um, I don't know what the footage is like. I don't really care all too much. I mean, these dog sheep hunts, they're, they're really for me, I mean, um, I, I would rather, I, I would rather take home a doll sheep than, than to, to film. Uh, I love filming, but, um, man, I just really want a sheep bad every year, real bad. And sometimes <clears throat> you just gotta go solo. I do know one thing, I'm really good at gear bombs. Real good at gear bombs. That is 
is a sweet sight to wake up to. On my way out, it was really tough to, to film, set anything up for uh, me walking by. I'm I'm swamped right now. Literally, I'm in the swamp. Just marching through Muskeg, it is tough. But uh, I got a couple more miles. I'll be back to my boat, my stash. Just exhausted. A couple miles, and I'll be back to my stash. Nope, here we go. Nobody's harder than me, I'm a breaker of chains, I'm living it free. Trust what I said and not what you see. Nobody keep it in order like me. I'm really a beast and I'm out in the wild. The girl in my eye and I want it right now. That's a vow when I gotta get it. The victory's mine. You tryna compete, it's wasted time. I came from the bottom, but now I'm in front of the line. In front of the haters, I turn into motivators. I don't hold no favors and any beef and get catered. I'm on my way, doing my flex, running it up, getting my checks. I got the power, give me respect. I live this life and on to the next. Made it back down to the river. Um, drank a cold beer. Ate some milk duds. And now I'm getting ready to start this float. Here we go. Headed out. Made it back to the river. Got man's best friend. He doing his thing. Cricks. All right. We're going home. We're going home. Hard to beat a steaming little meal. Checking in with the fam. That one cold beer left. Real hard day. Talking substantial. It's all good. I can camp anywhere I want to. I got my camp on my back. Christmas is in bed. And uh, I'm getting ready to join him. That's where he's at.